Today on the show we're taking a look at the pop animation Rainbow Bright number 380, Rainbow Bright and Twink. So stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. As I said, today on the show we're taking a look at the pop animation Rainbow Bright number 380, Rainbow Bright and Twink vinyl figures. Very nice box. Uh, you got the rainbow look. You got the old school rainbow bright logo there in the middle. Turn it around. Uh, this this box was meant to stand out. Uh, this is how I display all my pops from this side. So I had a little bit of trouble finding the right spot to place her in in my collection because the rainbow and the bl real light blue with the stars doesn't really mesh with well with the display side of my other pops. I ended up placing her somewhere where she wouldn't stand out too bad uh, in between my phantom vinyl figure and my space ghost. Take a look at the back. Here we've got Rainbow Bright with Twink and the Rainbow Bright logo. There's that side. There's the top. And the bottom. I found this at GameStop yesterday. Uh, right as he came in, I found her. My wife came across the Funko collectible uh, Scrooge McDuck action figure first, and then I saw her. I had to get them both. I've been wanting them both for a while, and it's not because I really like Rainbow Bright all that much. She she's okay. I just like the look of this pop. Uh, very very nice. I've had. Let me move her out of the way for a minute. I'm going to go ahead and back this up. I have had this guy for what seems like forever. He was one of the uh, bad guys on Rainbow Bright. Uh, as you can see, got a little bit of water damage. Uh, but I kept him, you know. That's kind of what made me decide to pick up this Rainbow Bright Funko. Uh, was this was one of my favorite stuffed characters as a kid. As you can see, my parents wrote my name on the shoe. Uh, since then, I have changed my last name, so that no longer applies, but, you know, it is what it is. But there's that, and I don't, for the life of me, remember this guy's name. I gave ended up giving him to my son. Hopefully he gets as much joy out of him as I did. So with that being said, let's go ahead and open this one up and take a look inside. Alright, so first things first. Funko went the extra mile with the display stand for this Rainbow Bright. And made the display, sp display stand rainbow colored as well. Which I think is really cool. Uh, up next we have Twink. He has no articulation at all, uh, but he was Rainbow Bright's little f friend, little companion type deal. I'm not sure what, how much of a role he played in the series, but I do remember seeing him in the cartoon. And he doesn't really stand up that great. So we may have to put Rainbow Bright on her stand and then lean him up against her. Uh, we... Then we have Rainbow Bright right here. Okay, so with this, you got one peg that's a little bit bigger than the other. Uh, she does not go on there that well. You gotta really force it, so be careful. But once she does, the stand isn't going anywhere. Uh, and like with all Funko Pops, or most anyway, her head does turn side to side. Um, it can go all the way around, um, kind of, uh, but it can only go about that far until her hand kind of stops it. Just got to bring it back around. And then we'll stand Twink right there. Uh, the, the paint on this on these is very nice, very, very solid. 
Uh, there's almost no paint bleeding at all. Which, with a figure like this that's multicolored like this, you would think there would be quite a bit of paint bleeding. Uh, but I'm very surprised that there's almost none. There's a little bit of white on the belt there, but not much. And with Rainbow Bright here, there's a little bit of yellow where the green is on her belt. Uh, I'm not seeing any other paint bleeding really at all, except for the white on her boots is going into the uh, blue and the green a little bit. But overall, it's not bad. It's not a bad pop at all. Uh, very nice looking. So we'll stand them there just like that. For now. Um, she won't remain in her stand because of the way the uh, clamshell is. Uh, the spot for her stand is right here, and then you put her in. So I will have to take the stand off her feet, attempt to anyway. Uh, but again, a very nice pop, very well done. Uh, like I said, I've been wanting to get this one for a while now since it was announced, just because of how cool it looks. So anyway, there you have it, guys. Today we took a look at the Pop Animation, Rainbow Bright 380, Rainbow Bright and Twink vinyl figure. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. I'm Shannon for Comagen TV. The only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, my friends. This is Comagen TV.